Hello, everybody, and welcome back once more to How to Date a Magical Girl. I am the Outback Owl. I'm Yin and Young. I'm Chibi Doo. I'm Envy Jitters. I'm Cece. And I'm Cozy. And we're back once again. We're gonna, we're gonna, what were we doing? I think we, we met a tomboy last time. And oh. some other, wow, we do not have that many save files. Oh, she stuck kinda... her hand in the ramen. Oh, yeah. yeah that she, was weird. She, she grabbed some of our wet noodles. I'm into this one. Okay. Yeah, what were we up to? Calendar day is, what is today? Hang on. Today. It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday, my dudes. So that means we're in alchemy oh. class right now. <laughs> Our schedule for today. Okay, so we got what's her face in two places and other what's her face in two places, and then everyone else is not okay. alive. Okay. Where okay. is our where is our fifth <laughs> affection meter? The most important affection meter. I think we I think we need met her. I think we need to like become friends first. Yeah. Oh. You haven't started the route yet. Have we unlocked Cafe Shiba yet? We've we, been there, yeah, but, but I don't think we've unlocked it. Ah, so we have to go there through story stuff, I see. I mean, yeah, we might as well just go to school at this point. There's nothing else to do. Yeah. Is this where we're gonna meet the per- uh, I'm narrator, right? Yeah, Been a while. yeah. As I'm on my way to my first class, I run into Kauri in the hallway. Which one's the- oh, oh. shit. That's me. <laughs> That's me. Hey, watch where you go! Eh. I mean, what a pleasure it is to see you this morning! That's better. Hey, Kauri? Kauri? How are you going? How, How are, are you, you going? going? <laughs> That's a question. <laughs> I'm, well, I've actually just been window shopping before school. Window shopping? Okay. This early? Oh yeah? What do you have your eye on? Not got, that I care. They got some fucking time in Japan, I guess. I guess so. Well, it's not like you care, but uh, there's a really nice pair of gloves on sale. I should have enough money by next week to get them. Best of luck. Hmm, nice. Are you pinching pennies to save up? <laughs> pinching pennies? How dare you? I'm not some peasant. Really? I come from a very wealthy family, I'll have you know. Gee, shocker. I, uh, just, uh, my assets are tied up right now, you know? Stocks, bonds, all that sort You've been of cut off the baddies. I've been planning to speak to my financial advisor very soon. You, your daddy. Yeah. <laughs> ah, I see. Well, I hope you can get those gloves soon. He's trying to tell us what gift to yes, give her Yes, because... absolutely. No. That's no, absolutely bad. not. I mean, we have zero affection for them because we have zero affection for them. <laughs> Gotta keep it that way. Yeah. Thank you. I can't put my finger on your financial status. Are you rich, just like me? Or were you born in the gutter? Um, um Well, it was great talking to you, Cowrie. See ya. Um, neither? Neither? What is neither supposed to mean? Don't tell me you're middle class. We can only dream of being middle class no, anymore. No, I think we would qualify as rich. Like, we're rich enough that our parents gave us our own place. I don't know. Japan is, like, kind of different. Yeah, it's, it's pretty typical when you go off to college that you get your own apartment. I mean, hell, there's high schoolers that live on their own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like, I, I just assume that rent is not as American murderous <laughs> over there. <laughs> well, I guess I am. I've never really thought about it. How <laughs> dreadful! I've got a newfound pity for you now. Hey, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Jeez, thanks. You know, if you're one of the up in the world, you've got a long way to go for middle class. I suggest getting a part-time job or for three. I already no, that sounds American. Thing. Yeah, that sounds real American. Yeah. Well, yeah. well, how do you expect to capture the heart of a pretty girl? For one, could never date a middle class nobody. I'll keep that in mind. Well, this middle class nobody doesn't want anything yeah, to do with you. Yeah, this is a we good only, thing. We only interact with you because the story says we have to. Think about that. Make sure that you do. I bet you stay in your fucking lane. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see the last episode? Yes. We uh, 
got her to be nice to us. Yeah. And she's failing miserably. Yep. Yeah. It, it, it's like it's like a it's like a thing. You gotta, it's like a cat. You got to train her to like be nice. Hey, be nice. <sighs> yep. I get the spray bottle. Oh, you know what? I would love to use a spray bottle on her. <laughs> I think that'd be great. That's that's the next game mechanic we need to add in. As I sit in class today, I remember my conversation with Miu and Ray. Ray. We Ray. 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 From yesterday. I can't help but feel the pressure of Miu's expectations on my shoulders. She wants me to study hard, to get good grades, and ace my exams. Was Ray the tomboy? Yes. I think so. Noodle cup. But the weight of her expectations is making it even harder to actually concentrate on studying. I feel like I'm just going to disappoint her, no matter what. If I don't do well in my exams, will I fail at the academy? Yes. Come on, man. Bees get degrees. Well, we're forced to be here, so yeah. can you actually fail? Well, I mean, I guess you just don't get a license you or something. You might have to start again. Oh, God. From the top. Forever no. school. Terrible. If I'm going to spend so much time here, I should at least put in a little effort. So, from today on, I'm going to use my time more effectively. I'll study hard and make everyone proud of me. Is this like telling us we've been playing Yeah, we need to study. But what have we been studying? We've been studying how to make money better, which is good. So, but. the thing is, is that I feel like what the this first month has been for us is introductions to the characters. Oh god, we haven't even started the game yet, have we? No. Oh god. We're still like... We're in tutorial. In, we're oh, in the god. tutorial. It's a Persona game. The game doesn't usually start until like a couple months into the school year. Oh god. <laughs> I feel like we've gotten like through three books. Oh, I can now travel that's... to the lab, field, and park. Well, that's good. We don't know what it'll do for us, but that's good. <laughs> oh, I think like the alchemy lab got opened up for us if we okay. want to go hang out with someone there. Like the crazy teacher. Eek. Gotcha. And we didn't even go to class. Um... Yes, we did. We were thinking about that altered class. As a student normally does, you know, don't think about class while you're in class. When I reach the school gates, I'm surprised to see no less than five girls waiting for me. Oh, uh, your hair oh. is here. It would seem <laughs> that Ray, my newest <laughs> friend, has joined my lovely I did not intend that. I did not intend it. <laughs> oh, we knew what was intended. Ah, oh, oh, there no. she is. Yes. Yo, I can't believe you've got so many girls waiting for you. I know, right? Oh, wow. Are you a little heartbreaker? What's the deal? Um... Okay, it's just okay. <laughs> we're just okay. So <laughs> to be fair, that's exactly the joke we're going for. Right? How do you guess that these are my friends? Well, you know, three of them are. Mimi told me, of course. Mimi. Mew. I introduced Ray to everyone this afternoon. I figured I couldn't keep her existence a secret any longer. I hope that's okay. Why are you trying secret? to- secret? Yeah, why are- what? what? What are you trying to do that for? Mimi, why you gotta talk like you're ashamed of me? Ah, um. so she's ashamed of you. I am ashamed of you. <laughs> so, wait, who's the Mickey Mouse one? That's uh, you. Yui. That's, that's you. Yeah, that's you're, you're, you're basically Homura. Alright, right, right. Yeah, makes sense. I'm not ashamed of you, Ray. I just wish you'd work harder. Blah. Oh, fine. That's Mickey Mouse! Mouse. Why, our group certainly has gotten lively! I never expected to make so many friends at the academy! Oh. <laughs> Are you friends? I don't know. Yeah. I should hardly make any friends in my first year. And yet, you all meet each other so quickly? Maybe that's because you're a bitch. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, mean, I feel like that's more of a you thing than an us thing. <laughs> don't worry, Kaori. You're part of the group now. Oh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> It doesn't matter if you're a second year. We'll still love you. I mean, no. aren't those two are, aren't Ray and Can me I the throw third myself years? out? <laughs> aren't Ray and me three years so? Uh, yeah, Ray and me might be upperclassmen. At this yeah, point. I think they're third so, years. Yeah. Thanks, Akari. I'm glad to have so many friends now. Even if some there, even if some of them are complete. Idiots. Nope. Don't say it. Sprinkle. <laughs> Like, what? sorry, go ahead. Well, anyways, okay, you gotta choose one of us. No. For what? Well, yeah, mm. Ray, it's Ray. Yeah. Uh... Oh, we're trying to... Aw, you know, it's pretty damn clear that okay just wants us to be But so you gotta pick. You can't have us all. Um, but I we mean, don't have high enough affection with any of them. I freeze in fear. This is a trap. <laughs> <laughs> 
This is 100% a trap. It's a trap. This is a trap. This is a trap. This is a trap. It's a trap. <laughs> don't answer the question. Don't answer the question. Don't answer the question. Don't answer I, I don't like being friends with all of you. Ray shuffles around before bursting into a fit of laughter. <laughs> Yo, I totally had you going. <laughs> you should have seen the look on your face. The rest of the girls visibly relax, I can tell. They weren't in on the joke. I'm gonna say, uh, hey, Kari, before I get the brass knuckles ready to fight somebody. Yeah. If yeah. you believe that Ray wasn't serious, I feel like I can let my guard down. And now is when she strikes. But seriously, I play hard to get, okay? Don't think I'm easy. If you want to get with me, you better treat me right. <laughs> oh, I don't know, honey. You just stuck your hand in our ramen cup. Yeah. I, I think you might just be the one that we have to hey, worry about. Hey, she can grab our wet noodle anytime. If we had to work hard for anyone, I feel like it would be me. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. But also, when we have four other easy girls. I'm going to be honest with you. I feel like the one you have to work the hardest for is Kauri, but we're we not going it. to. That's true. Like, I'm genuinely wondering, because I know there is someone who's into that, but who is it? Well, and what what's, what went wrong with that? I, I feel like this is like a, like, you almost got to max out your stats like Monster Prom in a way, where like, uh, Miyu wants smarts. I get that. Um, Kauri wants money. Yeah. Uh, Hikari probably wants fun. Miyu probably wants, not Miyu. Um, I don't necessarily Miyu know that any of these are like actual stats. I know, I'm just... But it might be though. That's what, I was what I'm too. asking is, how many people are actually going to go after Cowrie? They're called pay pigs. Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. When you say we're going to have to work hard for Cowrie, like quite literally work hard because it's all working as a part time job to get money. Yeah, I'm not yeah. doing it. <laughs> um, uh, I don't know. I feel like she's desperate enough that if you if you like don't pay her any attention she'll give up and like throw herself at you we've been trying to not pay attention to her and it's caused problems so maybe She's you're right problem with us. yeah oh god i think it's because we show no interest that she's interested. Well, then no. she should be interested in everyone because no one likes her. <laughs> like Except Hikari. It's like that episode of the Fairly Odd Parents. I think Hikari's <laughs> like, I'm not threatened by you because OK obviously hates you. <gasps> That's true. It's like that episode of the Fairly Odd Parents. I'm ignoring you. I said I'm ignoring you. Stop ignoring me. I'm ignoring you. <laughs> yep. <Yeah. laughs> the rest of the girls giggle along with her. It definitely seems like Ray is the life of the party. OK. Don't we want to be with the party? No. We Not with like the noodle party. cup thing. Like what is your guys' problem with the noodle it was cup weird. there? <laughs> Don't it was put weird. your hands in my food. Okay, well, okay, there's six of us. Maybe we should do a democratic vote to see which girl we want to go after. <laughs> well, when the game fully opens up, we'll do that. Yeah, yeah. Um, I think the noodle cup thing counted as second base at least, and that was a little too soon after just meeting her. I'm in. I'm in for it. <laughs> I thought that maybe my taste could be peaceful, but as long as these girls are around, I don't think I'm going to get any rest. Whee. Oh, well, I'm pretty sure this is what I've always wanted anyway. Five lovely ladies that all seem to tolerate me, at the very least. Wow. Picking only one to be with is a tough choice. But I vow to have a girlfriend by New Year's Eve. That's my goal, and I'm sticking to it. If I focus on just one of these girls, I can probably woo her and try to win her heart. Let the challenge begin. Ray is now available to spend time with. I can check her schedule to see where she hangs out. This is like, we've yeah. mentioned that this is like stalker behavior, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, maybe check the schedule to see. Okay, so they're okay. all unavailable. Except for two of them. Yeah. Okay. Uh, question. Because we've been reading books at night. Mm -hmm. Are we done with our book? Uh... I can't remember. Don't think so. Okay, so we don't need to exchange anything at the library. No. You know what? I said we, we should vote whenever whenever the full game opens up, and I think at this point the full game has basically opened up. Okay. Who are we going for? And well, I yeah. I don't think it has fully opened up though, because most it of has? the hangout spots yeah, aren't open yet. So. Okay. But these are all the girls. Yeah, we've unlocked all the affection bars essentially. Right? Yeah, um, but we're very limited in who we can actually hang out with right now. So you're saying that we should make a full choice whenever we can finally see a full schedule for everyone? A full schedule where we can actually access them. Okay. Okay. I'll... Yeah. All right, then. 
Um, so then do we want to hang out with um, Hikari and Yui? Let's see. Let's hang on. Let's we, see what we have available for our options right now. Is Cafe Shiba open? Because... Uh, no. No. Okay. So we really only have two choices here between yeah. Hikari and Yui right now. Mm -hmm. And then um, I would think like the last thing you would do is probably head home. Yeah, we're gonna have to. Uh, oh. Well, let me let me throw this out there. We can choose Hikari or Yui. Uh, after which we could go to work, and yeah. like at night we could do the the reading thing and get get a little smarter. Well, no, no. Because our reading time is our nighttime activity usually, and that takes up a full section. Yeah. Of our... So whoever we oh. hang out with right now is gonna take up our like late afternoon. Right. I thought there was a thing where we were just at home doing, and we did something. No. I guess we don't get that. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's our nighttime thing, usually. All right. Well, yeah, then Hikari or Yui. Unless we want to, like, try one of these, like, new locations. Um, so, as far as our con our affection is concerned, Yui's down here. Uh-huh. Hikari's got more. Do we want to even them out? We can keep them neck and neck. Yeah. Just so that way the playing field's a little... Yeah. Even yeah. For the two of them. As long as we have like, if we can start like at a good spot for like our four actual interests, mm -hmm. you know, I think that's good. No matter what, Kauri stays at zero. Right. <laughs> oh, always. I mean, I don't think anyone's gonna argue with that. I watch one person in the comments like, Kauri's my favorite. Why would you do that? Yeah. Okay. Well, and I we're know. like, what have you done with your life? And we're like, and so here's our PayPal. Yeah. Yui's affection for me is, yeah, we yeah. get it. We can't date the hotties. All right? We get it. I'm not reading it again. This is the same thing that shows up every single fucking time. Because it's like, you're a loser. You can't get a date. But we can hang out. So we hang out with Yui and discuss world pop. Well, this went south quick. Wow. I must have dozed off because <laughs> Yui is nowhere to be found when I opened my eyes. Wow. wow. Oh, but <laughs> we still gain one affection. Okay. Well, that sucked. <laughs> Worst date ever. Read a book. Yeah, we might as well. I, we're probably close to finishing this. Um, okay, magic book. Uh, chapter two. Okay, so we just started this thing. Yeah, we so we read one the night before. Oh, so we were in the middle now. We can, yes. we can get the second one. And, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. cool. Diving the book, tension, reading, blah, blah, blah. Time ticks by. So we can stay awake while reading, but we mm -hmm. can't stay awake while the girl we're trying to romance <laughs> is talking to us. I mean, we've before. already gotten the panty shot out of her. I assume that it's like we were actually interested in this book of magic and we just weren't interested in global hey, politics. That's our day. <laughs> okay. My head is foggy when I wake up this morning. Oh no. I have to use all my energy to force myself to get out of bed. My limbs are heavy. And I feel like I'm going to vomit. Oh, I'm no. spaghetti. What the hell is going on with me? Did I catch a cold overnight? Oh, God. God, this is such a nice fucking place. Yeah. Exactly. That's yeah. why I'm saying, like... I think middle class in Japan is way above our middle class here. Yeah. I managed to stumble into the kitchen. I try to prepare something for breakfast, but I don't think I can stomach food right now. Maybe I should skip school for the day. I feel absolutely dreadful. No, then we don't get affection for people. But more than that, I have a sinking feeling in the pit of my stomach, an otherworldly sensation that I've never felt before. Somehow, I can sense that something terrible is going to happen today. I don't know why, but my body is warning me of danger like some sort of premonition. I'm not a superstitious person. I don't believe in having a sixth sense or in, se in seeing signs from above. But this feels real. This feels curious. I've never experienced anything like it. An anxious gnawing deep inside of me. How have you never thought of this when you live in a world with magical girls? <laughs> this is like... It's like, I live in a world with wizards, but I don't believe in magic. <laughs> if something truly is going to go down today, I need to get to the academy. If I stay home, I'd just be worried sick anyway. <clears throat> I gather my belongings and head out the door! In the corner, I agreed by none other than my new friend, uh, Ray. Hey, yo, what's happening? Oh, you don't look so hot. Damn it. You feeling okay? Why can't we look hot? Yeah, I'll be fine. Ray, has anything happened this morning? Hmm, 
Nah, I don't think so. I was chatting to Mimi just before. Aside from that, can't say anything fun is going on. Mimi, where are you? I will say, they did death flag Hikari a few episodes back. They did. And what, what was the specifics for that? They were like, oh, I can't imagine her not being by my side uh, and all fun. that. So I do, she did. I do remember from the screenshots. Yeah. She did. That someone is going to die. Yeah. If oh, only, exactly. Why couldn't it be Kaori? Yeah. <laughs> Have you seen the other girls? Hikari, Yui, or Kaori? Is it the person with zero affection? Because we can, we can totally choose this person. Nah, sorry. We're here pretty early though. Yeah, true. Judging by Ray's attitude, nothing bad has happened at the school. Maybe I got all worked up over nothing. But how else do you explain the feeling I had? Hangover? Hmm? By the way, I know I teased you yesterday about having to pick one of us girls to date, but I wasn't really serious, okay? We could be serious. I don't know if the other girls are even interested in you, <laughs> so... But you are? I mean, yeah. Look, if you ever wanted to take me out on a date, I probs wouldn't say no, you know? Why? Because we feed you? Yes. I mean... She just that ramen. Hey, you know, again, you can grab a wet noodle if you want. Ray blushes just a little. Uh, it's strange seeing her become bashful all of a sudden. Anyway, if you're ever interested, treat me to a hot lunch or something. I'm a pretty simple girl. Food and honesty is all I care about. I can get behind this. Didn't she just say she was hard to get? Yeah. yeah that was part of the joke, I, I guess. Yeah, I think she likes to joke around. Um, so Aye. I guess money for her too? Thanks, just food. <laughs> Don't mention it. I'll be waiting for you. <laughs> Ray wanders away and I lean against the wall to catch my breath. Any other day, I wouldn't believe that a cute girl had practically just given me permission to ask her out. But today, I just don't feel all there. The gnawing sensation in my stomach remains, and it isn't fading away. Oh, God. While I'm trying to calm myself down, I look out the window and notice something unusual outside. Oh, God. The sky is looking a little darker, and heavy clouds are hanging overhead. Normally, I wouldn't think anything of it, but since the skies were clear just a minute ago, it feels a little strange. Mm. I feel a tap on my shoulder and nearly jump out of my skin. Eek. Sorry, okay? I didn't mean to scare you. Yes, you did. Why would you do this? Oh. Hikari. Jeez, you startled me. Sorry. Hikari follows my gaze and looks outside. Is it gonna rain? I mean, is that weird? I'm not sure. Ugh. <laughs> The forecast this morning said clear skies all day. Looks like Cowrie's an idiot. Is is here now too? I nod mm -hmm. at her and turn my attention to the window once more. You know, away from Cowrie. Uh, are there you seeing Yui today? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I saw her earlier. She said she was going to the lab early to practice her alchemy. Why do you ask? Okay. No reason. Oh no! Without warning, the entire academy starts to shake violently. Cthulhu. Eek! What's happening? Oh my god, I don't know what's happening. Uh, the girls are thrown from their feet and hit the ground. I managed to keep my balance, but I'm still slammed into the wall with such force. Oh my god, what could ah, ah, oh god, oh, it's shaking. I don't know what's happening, man. This is a big first tremor. Reach out. We gotta find out what happens next time. Goodbye! Bye! Bye. Hey, thanks for watching, and if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell icon for notifications. If you enjoyed this video, give us a like, and feel free to check out some of our other gaming videos, our weekly podcast, Anime Yay or Nay, or our parody series, Madoka Magically Abridged. See you next time! <laughs>